Going all the way back to Microsoft's dual screen device, the Surface Duo, and even now with some other devices that happen to have two screens, maybe in a slightly different way. One of the features I see people talk about in my comments more than any other with these sorts of devices that never arrived, that we never got with these devices, is the ability to mirror or to basically show two things, show something on one screen and on the other. Of course, with Surface Duo or Duo 2, you can put that device into a tent mode and then it would make sense potentially you have it on a table in front of you and you're watching a movie. Let's say the movie's on your side, the movie's also on their side. That would be kind of a cool thing to be able to do. Maybe you're playing Battleship or something, some other game or something like that. That would also make pretty good sense with these sorts of devices. Now with foldables, uh, like we currently have them, these sorts of foldables, it's not quite the same thing because you have a screen here and then you have a screen on the inside, but you could still do some similar things, right? So maybe you've got it in a stand or something and there's same sorts of things, a movie here and a movie here that you are actually watching. So there's plenty of opportunities to do interesting things. We've also seen Google with the Pixel Fold and their translator app that has uh, basically this functionality where you, you've got text on your side, they've got text on their side, and it's live translating for both parties, which is very, very cool. But again, that's pretty much it. Nobody else, no other app is doing anything like this unless you ignore the fact that the ZTE Axon dual screen devices from like 10 years ago had the ability to natively mirror one screen onto the other screen. Don't know why it's taken this long for this sort of thing to arrive on other devices. Why Microsoft couldn't bake something like that into the Duo, not exactly sure. I'm rambling. Let's talk about today's news story because this is finally somewhat being addressed. Article by Michelle Roman, who we have cited many times on this uh, YouTube channel. Android 14 finally lets app sh apps <laughs> show content on both screens on a foldable. Basically what's happening here, and I'm gonna drop a link in the description down below to this article, is that we are getting an update to the Jetpack Window Manager library within Android 14. Jetpack Window Manager is something that's used by a ton of different applications. Surface Duo made use of it as well. And this new update is allowing you to show content on both sides. You can see sort of a demo application here of sorts. I guess that's what this is, dual screen activity, and then you flip it around, and there you go. You've got text being shown at the top of that screen as well. Z Fold 5 image credits, Andrew Myrick. Now to make this clear, this is something that it's going to have to be implemented on an app by app basis. This isn't, you know, Google rolling this out, this ability like the ZTE device to have the same app open twice. It would be really cool in theory since most apps or at least a lot of apps have the ability to scale or to change between different layouts. How cool would it be if you could have an app open on your tablet screen and then basically hit a button or do a thing and that same app will then be running again on the inner screen just kind of in a different format. Maybe have to be scrunched down. Maybe it would force this app, this version of it to be the non-tablet version, and then it would run it out here scrunched down. Maybe they can make that work. It'd be a little bit more complicated because the screen sizes are different, but nonetheless, something that theoretically could potentially be done. This is not that. This is something that each individual app developer would have to implement into their device and of course, or into their app. And of course, not, not all apps are going to make sense for this sort of functionality. I'll also be interested to see if this is something that's doable on Surface Duo. Now maybe with uh, Ty's Android 14 ROMs, it's gonna be easier to do because it's running Android 14, but the actual you know, Microsoft release of the OS is still stuck on Android 12. So is there any way to implement this sort of thing on the older version of Android. I don't know, maybe you have to have Android 14 to do this. It's kind of what it sounds like from this article. I'm not a developer, but that's definitely what it sounds like. The OnePlus Open, of course, running Android 13. So as of this moment, also not something that theoretically would work on the OnePlus Open, but 14 is coming. 14 is gonna be there pretty soon. Z Fold's got it with the beta of One UI 6, and that's gonna be launching very, very soon. And of course the Pixel Fold has long been on Android 14 for a great many of us. So at any rate, guys, I just thought this was kind of cool. This is a step in the direction that I think a lot of us have wondered why this wasn't already a thing. This seemed like an obvious thing in particular, going back to the Surface Duo days, finally coming. Shout out to Michelle for this uh, great reporting, another great article. Like I, like I said earlier, link in the description 
go click it, go give it a read because there's plenty more stuff in there, a bit of a deeper dive into some of the uh, developer jargon that maybe you are craving that I'm just not going to get into on this channel. At any rate, thanks for watching. Subscribe for more content like this. And until next time, stay nerdy, my friends.